I'll be posting a video every day this week to celebrate how much I love you guys and also for the holidays. Today's topic is a do yourself gift idea but you can also make these for yourself too because they're extremely gorgeous. I've been seeing these on so many fashion bloggers. I'm going to show you guys how to make this in two different methods so that you can know how to make this real quick. The best part, this is the perfect last minute gift idea because you know we all love bling of course. And they're so affordable that you won't be going broke when you make these for your friends. As you can find all these at your local craft store and also like think the mall. I'm going to show you why you want to go to the mall too. First off, I'm measuring my wrist bone to get the best fit. I'm using a measuring tape or use a chain leg that you'll be using to estimate your wrist size. My wrist size is around 6 inches so I round it up for an inch for extra wiggle room. And if you want to tie, you can always remove links after you're done. At the craft store, search for crystal beads. They come in a variety of shapes and colors. And I'm going to show you two ways to make these beautiful bracelets with these two types of style beads. So the first tool I'm using are side cutters and if you decide to go with string beads, this is the method. You're going to cut the beads off the string. Snip snip. Uh, anyway, so it's going to take up about an inch of my measurement. So now I have 6 inches left to measure out my chain links. You can get these at the craft store online or if you can't find what you're looking for, use a belt or something cheap like a necklace from your favorite clothing store like me. I got this for $5 so I'm using this for my bracelets. This right here is your best buddy of all when it comes to jewelry making. I'm using a set of pliers to pull one end and push the other end to open up the links apart. With my set of pliers, I'm pulling the links apart in half to wrap around my wrist so later on I can wear them. Okay, here comes a little elbow grease. I'm using eye pins to connect the glass bead to my curve link. You can also use jewelry wire. Just make sure that your jewelry wire is thin enough to fit through the bead. Now I'm going to close the long wire on the open end by bending it into a small loop just like the other side of the eye pin with the round nose plier. And you're going to snip the rest with your side clippers and also flatten out with your pliers to make a perfect loop just like the other side. The rest is easy. Open up your link chains up and connect them to the loop eye pin on each side of the crystal. The last part of this step, choose a closer clasp. I wanted the magnetic clasp to make my life so much easier when I'm throwing my arm candy together. Definitely save some time when I'm getting ready. So you're going to add two jump rings to each end of the clasp. Open up your jump rings and link them to the ends of your bracelet links. It's complete and all you have to do is add a little cute charm for extra cuteness if you want. I added 3 extra jump rings so the charm extends out when I'm wearing them and it just looks really cute when it's dangled and you know you're waving your arm. Oh snap! Almost done you guys! This is the easiest out of the two bracelet styles. You're going to locate beads that have two punctured holes for a quick link up. While I was making these, I decided to color them. I went with the tint effect. I used two colors of nail polish on one side and a generous amount of top coat polish to prevent chipping from wear. Now you can see a difference. It's so pretty. Now grab a curb link bracelet. I'm using a belt since I didn't want to wait and like order them online. So I just got it at the mall. Choose the biggest jump ring that you can find and connect the stone to the curb link. Ta-da! So simple, isn't it? And just add the finishing touches when you're done. Isn't this so gorgeous? So this is the perfect jewelry gift. It's wearable and of course sparkly. Wear it alone as a statement piece. Add some leftover chain links for a double wrap look. Mix and match with your other bracelets for your own arm candy swag. If you decide to make these, make sure to tag me with hashtag Beauty Spurge to Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook. And don't forget, new videos all week. So come visit again. Love ya!